afternoon guys what it do um today's oh gosh today's friday july 1st so happy new month uh today it is well yesterday was the beginning of you know the care fiesta vibes out here in montreal quebec fortunately i wasn't able to attend the first event which was like a liming in the parking lot because your girl was at work till like the wee hours in the morning here anyhow today is friday and there is a party juve party um i think there's like more than one but i'll be working at one where lyrical sweet up sweet up lyrical will be at so that's gonna be fun i'm gonna do my hair i'm gonna show you guys like the aftermath and probably just do like a separate video of me doing that a hairstyle and then tomorrow please god my god mom is in town and i haven't seen her in years and she doesn't go to the parade unfortunately which i'm kind of like i'm kind of like it's like a tug of war like go to the parade go see your god mom but i really 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 want to see my god mom um so i'm gonna go spend some time with her and plus i have work in the evening anyway so i don't want to be like beat for work and work be beating me up too so i'm not trying to be double beat you know what i'm saying like no not a cute look so I'm going to spend time with my god mom and then go to work. Um, then after that, I'm going to see my Patsy. <laughs> That's really like the biggest thing that I want to do this weekend for Carnival Weekend. Uh, I got some outfits tonight. I'm bartending. So I don't know if I want to do like the, you know, classic all black or if I want to do like something different, you know. But I, either way, I'm coming out looking like a schnock like somebody's bueno bar that's on that period um and then what else what else what else tomorrow please god i have my dress so the second option I'm not doing it anymore too much of mm -mm, too much of too much of stuff i might save that for like a different outing down the line i got me my army pants i'm so happy because i love you my army pants uh, I had to like rebuy a pair because the one that I have they're getting kind of tight on me and they're not long I wanted like a long one as well and one that you know fits in, like the me now I've been eating Oreos what do you think and um so yeah, I have to go pick that up and um what else what else what else what else what else Sunday please God is the boat right clearly if we want to get back to how it was we need the supporters hence like I'd be one of the supporters Ashi. Oh, is camera ready? I'm thinking I got news. Eh, I think I shut the world to the news. I'm working anymore. I'm not playing anymore. Oh, gosh, I'm frost. Oh, look at the LMC. Just like a pancake. And when she went, no, no, I'm making in shit. But he don't sound like a volleyball. Hey guys, so I just came home. Well, not just came home. It's been like maybe two minutes now. Um, I'm just about to take off my bun. What time is it? 4.32 a.m. So I'm going to take off my bun. The party was nice. It was a really great experience. Um, the first time I saw Lero, 
I was partying. This time I was working. And it was just on the toilet while I do this so you guys can like see me so we could interact and engage. Now it was like really, it was really good. I had fun. It was hot because outside was just hot today so it was just like really hot. Um, but it was a good turnout. Like people came through early which is really good. And they had fun. Well I hope everyone had fun and I hope everyone got home Ooh, safely. Um... I got to speak to Leroy. I was just like, are you gonna be on the Uber cruise? You know? And he was just like, of course. And I was like, okay. Right, <laughs> now he's really chill. Like, to come outside and just see him, like, chilling in the parking lot, like, you know, like, that was, that was very humble. Like, I like stuff like that. I was outside in the parking lot, taking pictures with us, having conversations with us. That, that was, that was really cool. Like, respect to you, Leroy. That, that was really dope. I don't know if I was to that status, if I'd ever be able to like, if my anxiety would allow me to like do all of that already, like I come off as like standoffish or stush, which I'm really not. It's just, you know, if we get a chance to speak, we get a chance to speak. If we don't, you know, it might come across like that, but I, I don't know. But anyways, I just hope if that was ever my life in whatever way, that I'm like more known that I will still be able to take it with my people like comfortably and just you know like no no extra ish yeah I want to take off this bun too man oh yeah it was really nice I don't know something about the soca scene and just people like I was telling this girl the other day um I was just like, yo, honestly, if it's one thing about soca music, guys, if you haven't listened to soca music, you guys really need to. Because one thing about soca music is it just puts you in a happy, energetic mood. Like, not just a happy mood. It puts you in an energetic mood. Like, you're happy, you're energetic, you're just like, ah, oh, this was so good. You're just like, all right. Like, you know, you're ready to just start your day, you know, get shit completed and that's what soca is like it's a vibe it's a t it's really togetherness like it's really unifying like when like the season is around between people but it's also unifying with like all the caribbeans and then like people who are not from the caribbeans and they like you know they come across um the soca scene and they get into it like it just connects everyone together there's never any bad vibes like I'm not saying bash should never happen after a parade or anything because you know you know ignorance is ignorance and we just can't avoid that but it's just togetherness like you can have an arc or arch enemy and i'm telling you guys it's down the road you guys see you guys are going to end up you guys are probably going to end up winding up on each, uh, winding up on each other plus soka is a good vibe like i kid you not like i kid you not i kid you not I'm kind of like really disappointed that I won't be able that I think I won't be able to go out tomorrow to the parade because I really want to see like after the two years with this world event like I really would love to witness like you know do we still do we still have the oomph do we still have a chance to bring it back or is it like is it a wrap out here but anyways my
You guys, you already hear about my voice. Like, I already know. When some voice is like this, you know what type of night it was. Like, yo, I got to touch Patrice. Like, honestly, I never knew it was a groupie till this moment. Till the moment I was, like, less than two feet away from Patrice Roberts. I knew I was a groupie. Like, I was just like, wow. That's what you get for judging other people. <laughs> yeah, catch it back in your backside. That's exactly what happened. But honestly, yo, I think I'm gonna say that for a story time to let you guys know what really went down at the show. Like, what really, yo, if I would have missed Patrice Roberts, I would have been pissed. Pissed. I'm telling you guys, yo, I'm telling you. If you guys want, like, if you guys want a story time, 
just well it's not really much story time like i'll try to make it very short and sweet and simple because i really could banter but basically yo i had work today as i told you i think i told you guys i had work today so that's why i couldn't go to the parade right and at work i was like we finished late like i finished late at work so i was like trying to like make sure everything that you know pre-closed before it's time to go because when it's time to go i man must go okay so basically i left i came home showered like i already knew what i was wearing my breast because i had two outfits but, like i just stuck to the original plan which is a cute dress oh my god sorry i'm on the toilet <laughs> i literally just like came home not too long ago it's a really cute dress i'm trying to like see if i can get some clips or something of like the outfit but it's really really cute um if i don't like i'll probably like redo this look and just take some pictures because like it's like ugh. the way everything came to life I'm mad though because my it's like my arm piece like this blue piece is supposed to be like on top here too. I don't know when that thing break off, but clearly you guys know like I tell you guys this weekend is whatless. I'm surprised I'm still this intact and only this fell off. Like I'm really surprised that only this fell off. That's like basically. So almost missed patrice but still caught her she's so cute she's such a great performer her voice is on point even in real life i find to me if you if anyone went and like they noticed the same thing let me know down below because i find she sounded so great like you know obviously you know she has to take some breaks make the you know make the audience you know how you know how we you know how they do they have to make the audience sing because you know <laughs> we came out to sing too <laughs> and um yeah but overall, it was a great fit. I loved it. I really, really, really had a vibe. Like, I was on a vibe. I had a vibe. I stayed on that vibe. I really tried to. Um, everybody was outside. Everybody was outside. Um, but, yeah. So, I'm about to go take off the people that in peace. And um, do what I got to do. Maybe not. <laughs> and try to get some rest because tomorrow is tomorrow. God's for life. So, always something to do if you get to if you get a chance to see you know what i'm saying so yeah good night guys that's the end well no it's not the end of Cara fiesta tomorrow please god it's the boat ride so maybe i might just like walk down to the boat and like get some footage just to, like show but like i won't be going on the boat i'm still kind of like i don't even know what the word is to express it but like like if you guys know me those that know me you guys know like i don't care if it's two people showing up downtown i don't care when it comes to carnival i am there like it really has to take something like it has to be something like my rest like my health basically like i have to be i have to rest especially if i have work which i did and yeah and i came home like what four o'clock yesterday morning friday saturday morning yeah so i needed to sleep especially for tonight so i had to like pick I have to pick which battle we're gonna battle out and think this, you know? But yeah, so I am done babbling for real for all this time. We've gotten like what an extra minute of me just ranting, just talking to myself, but really talking to y'all, whoever is like tuning in. Thank you guys so much. And yeah, good night. Good morning. So it is currently what time is it? Ooh. Eleven. 11.34 already. Anyways, um, I woke up this morning. I had to go do a little sub song. Not too much of song song. Anyways. Um, and I'm going to get ready. Because I, like, I haven't seen my godmamas yet, eh? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I haven't seen my godmamas yet, so... I'm going to get to see her today. God's for our lives and God's for our plans. I'm going to get ready. So when she's ready, I'm ready. I'm going to go. I'm going to take you guys down by like the dock. By like where they set up for like where the boat ride. Where they're going to go um, to wait before um, boarding the boat for the boat ride. And um, yo, who knows? I might just end up on that shit. I'm telling you, I really might just end up on the boat. I promise you. I really, really promise you. Um last night i told you guys about last night already my voice is coming back well it's back i finally it's back there's a few little slight instances where it's like <laughs> raspy but it's okay it's fine um what should i call it what should i call it what should i call it so, yeah i'm gonna get yo let me show you guys my room because hot y'all all the hot y'all i'm playing look at the mess i'm living in like look at one weekend just look at my bed alone okay look, look at my bed alone one weekend one weekend i have no shame because you know when i clean up i clean up but just take a look around guys like let's look around this is just from doing my hair i have to clean that shit up 
this is a miscellaneous mess because I don't even know why it's messy. What are those? Uh, you guys, anyways, those of you who know, we're gonna keep it real here. We know, like when it's time, like when it's time to do ish, like it's just gonna be a mess. But I'm gonna take some time and tidy up and everything. I'm gonna take a shower. We'll have to eat first. So make some, I'm gonna make me my tea. Hey, 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 hey! Move yourself. Make myself some tea, feed up ash. My kitchen ain't so bad though. Like there's things I need to move around, but and it, like my dishes, my sink, clean, dirty dishes on the side. Um, I made a drink last night, Casamigos with some Coke. Wait, Casamigos and some Coke and some ish over there. I need to clean this up. But we're good, we're good, we're good. So I'm gonna do all that. I'll come back when I'm dressed up to go downtown, go to the old port. Guys, I might end up on the boat. Is someone selling a ticket for the right price? I just might end up on that boat, I promise you. But if I don't, I'm just gonna like probably just walk around and chill and do whatever else. So yeah, bye. Y'all, I'm ha I'm haunted. I'm haunted. I need to focus. Yeah. So I'm gonna go do my toes. I'm gonna just go fix up. Like I don't have the prettiest toes, but shit, I'm still gonna show. I'm still gonna show it love to make it look. You know. So I don't know if you guys remember. I did this. I did that since April, and we all know toes. Toes be lasting a long while, and I really was gonna hold out until like my birthday weekend even though i have no plans but still just to pamper myself i was gonna wait till then to do my toes but f that f that i'm about to make sure that they're nice and looking good so because like the outfits that i have in mind i would, it's gonna require an open toe um an open toe uh what's that word called open toe shoes wow so i'm just like you know what before anybody try to be like oh she's trying to look all on point from head to not the toe hell no you know you ain't gonna come for me hell to the no so i'm gonna go do that and then get back and start getting ready to go and yeah well, i tied up my room a little bit but there's still some miscellaneous stuff on my bed that needs to be put away but it's okay um those are like outfits and miscellaneous shit that needs to go in my closet and y'all already know you already know the process like don't even come for me i'm going outside with my bonnet i'm sorry monique you can come for me another day but today i understand like always being presentable don't get me wrong but sometimes like i be saying y'all i be my own enemy i be my own worst enemy and that's okay that's okay that's okay so yeah bye Alright guys, don't judge me. I'm dressed like if I'm going on the boat because you just never know. So that's what I'm doing.
I'm not even mad though. I'm not even mad. Like the risk, it doesn't even compare to how much fun I had on the boat and how much fun it was and how much fun we all had on that boat. Until the ending though. I'm not even gonna lie to you guys. I low key, high key had a whole panic attack because they weren't letting us out where we normally would come out of the boat, like where we're accustomed coming out from. And low key, just like all this has been going on in the world, I didn't wanna like, the feelings that I'm telling you guys that I'm expressing right now, I didn't want to bring it out on the boat because that would like send everyone into a panic. And like, Lord knows, sending a bunch of mother on a boat into a panic is way far worse than just me taking that out, going through like, if I'm about to get a heart attack to just save all. So much crazy shit was just happening around the world. It's just like a lot. Like, it's gruesome shit. At that point, like, just, just, yo, just put yourself in my shoes. Like, being on a boat where. It's like being on a plane in a sense, right? Like, the chances of having any chance is, like, I'm sorry, guys. Like, I might come across to a lot of people as negative because I just, I feel like, I feel like, I don't even know how to put this, but I just feel like, okay, yeah, I have, like, my fairy tale moments and I have a lot of those. But at the same time, like, I don't know. I just always think the worst in a sense, if that makes sense. But I just always think to the extreme of shit. And it comes across as very negative but like I'm very optimistic at the same time too I don't know if that makes sense but it makes sense like I'm both like I'm both so basically just picture yourself on a freaking boat with a bunch of people 
millions of people just you know going out to have a great time we did have a great time this shit was torn up it was a vibe it was a freaking vibe this whole weekend was a, such a freaking vibe uh, so you're on a boat with like maybe maybe 2,000 people if I'm not mistaken I'm gonna like double check how much that boat can actually the capacity of that boat including like the crew and everything and they won't let us out of where you're allowed to normally from where we're accustomed to come off of the boat like just imagine that and it's just like okay but why why can we come off the boat and it's weird because this one employee he was making me even more shook because the way he was acting is like i can't tell you right now um and he had like the, he had like he was just like <laughs> yo you guys are gonna be like nah bitch you have a lot of time to think <laughs> I do. I really do. <laughs> I really do. That's the fucked up shit. Like, you know? But he had, like, the, the black, like, dark shades. Like, you know, with the whole black suit. Mind you, he works for the freaking, um, bowl. He's telling me, I don't, I don't work here. It's not me who's making the rules. I don't, it's not like, okay, so who makes the rules? Like, can we speak to them, please? Because, like, why are we here? Like, you know? Um, he just kept giving, like, shady, fishy, not to the point answers. And that, like, was tripping me out even more. Like, squid games is that you like no like legit my heart pumping i'm never gonna lie to you guys so, so like how it was where we normally would exit me and the like the person in charge of the party like let's say from the, the party aspect we we're like at the front like at the line where we were accustomed to coming off from right and um basically there was like two other people next to us both of them i knew and eventually the lady who um who's a part of like the party they end up like going some they went on the other side like they, like they were telling us like the new side to come off of but anyways that's another you have to be there to understand i'm not gonna get into that because i'm just gonna keep getting to shit that you know besides the point this bad phenomenal woman like when i tell you she just said yo i need to get off and she just took the chain off and she was like yo f shit. like no i was like oh thank you They're, like thank god for the brave ones like we all have our moments to be brave in certain situations and like thank god for the like for that one that he sends to like do to do the do because it was yo i even told the guy i'm like yo i cannot breathe like i'm having a panic attack right now like it's so many people you're not like like you know like it's a different route route you're telling me shady shit um it's a bunch of us on this boat and like you know if this shit were to tip over like bro 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 lavi like oh bro yo people i love and care for and that others who are not even on the boat care for is on this boat right now like we need to make it home safely and alive like all of us even like the crew like everybody everyone every single one being you know but yeah we made it thank god we made it so that's what i'm saying like it was fun and honestly like it's worth the ticket like how much is it i'm, I'm really afraid to look because like in regular places it's pretty pricey we're in the old port i never got a ticket in the old port so um oh not bad it's only 80 dollars i mean that's so 80 dollars yeah honestly it was, it was worth it for the time that it was like okay like i don't have nobody nobody has money to just dash away so like don't get me wrong but to be honest like to be honest two things to be honest i really didn't plan to go on the boat ride even though i said you know i'm still gonna get dressed just in case it happens it just happens you know because the boat ride is a vibe but i my original plans i did not plan to go on this boat um but the smart thing that i should have done which i know i should have done but i didn't do because i'm stubborn at times was said like i'm not gonna go park where i normally would park i'll just take a risk so, yes i'm gonna take this l big dummy move big dummy moves i know i know and we're just gonna roll with the punches you know say la vie i'd spent less than than what this ticket is valued for the entire weekend so you see how i'm trying to like find ways to like make me like what's that is it a comfort pillow there's like a term like you put like a cushion under the person to make them like feel at comfortable and at ease or whatever like that's what I'm doing to myself right now. But next time, yeah. We all have moments, man. It's cool. It was worth it. I need to move from here. I've been talking for like so long. So, yeah. We's out.
I'm gonna go home. I have food at home. Can't be selling no more. And yeah. Maybe it's 6.45. Maybe I'm barely alive. Maybe you're taking my shit for the last time. Yeah. Not so long ago, I was dancing for dollars. Do what's really real if I let you be my mama. You don't want a girl like me. I'm too crazy. But every little bitch, you miss your school game. Good morning, guys. So it is Monday. Happy Monday. I have my tea with my lemon. You know, we gotta rejuvenate the body from a weekend. Well, I mean, I drink this every morning, but we still gotta rejuvenate. It's, what time is it? I need to get, I'm starting to get ready for work. I know it looks like I'm really not, but I really am. I really am. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. I really tried to capture, you know, just a bit of like what goes on in Montreal Care Fiesta. Unfortunately, I didn't get to go to the parade, so I didn't have, I don't have any footage from that. But you guys can go check out Cara Fiesta at on you guys can go check out Cara Fiesta on Instagram and then through there you could probably see um you know the different types of bands that we have. You know, trying to make a comeback. We're really trying to make a comeback and my fingers are crossed. I believe that it can happen. There's potential. There's so much potential here and just certain things need to fix around like like the time that we're given needs to be longer. Like that needs to be longer, it's a given. But yeah, honestly, Cara Fiesta, guys, wherever you go to celebrate Carnival, um, which is like, when I say Carnival, I mean like the Caribbean version of it, not the Ferris wheel version. It's just love. It's just togetherness. It's just unity. Like that's, that's the main message behind Carnival. You know, over time, yes, things did change in, you know, costumes and you know certain song lyrics might have changed just a little bit the message behind carnival if you look up the history it's really celebrating our freedom you know and uh yeah like if you don't like soca if you don't love carnival if you're not about that life then you're just not about that life okay the folks that get it get it and the folks that don't don't simple so you guys have a blessed week cheers to that we made it through where is your next carnival venture what are you doing for you know are you going to labor day are you going to miami carnival trinidad carnival is up in a few months are we organizing to take a trip together and go play a mass let me know down below don't be shy and as per usual blues stay blessed and stay safe blues see you guys in my next video ciao